Each Bomber Guy's video essay, Plagiarism in YouTube, concludes with holistic thinking on inspiration. He proposes citing content we've been informed by. YouTube is a beautiful cesspool of inspiration, remixing, riffing, parody. Drawing on existing ideas is a great way of making something new and unique. It's only wrong when you add nothing and try to pretend it was yours in the first place. Now we have generative AI and human fraudsters, so Harris proposes standards for stealing. This may involve citing or inspiration to sustain community spirit. If you find any happiness or success making something creatively, and you think I helped, thank you. I'm Andrew, and I've been making 200 second reviews of Always Sunny in Philadelphia. 200 seconds is a great format. I can bash these out quickly. They're fun to make, and they'll get a decent audience. Now let me tell you about another Andrew. Andrew at AXW made two minute peep show reviewing every episode over a year between 2019 and 2020. I love peep show and I love Andrew's videos. They're thoughtful and enthusiastic, sometimes annoyingly fussy. Those attributes in my opinion are a reflection of my own reviewing style. Notice how Andrew uses still images to go with his commentary. It's a handy way of pausing the moment. And I saw it too, a way of getting around my own limitations with video editing. I did not a timer to my videos because I'm not smart enough to know how to do that. A real jizzing. <laughs> right, yeah. I knowingly stole Andrew's concept, perhaps more than I initially realised, because Peep Show is the closest the UK has to the equivalent of Always Sunny. I make my videos 200 seconds because I'm not so concise. In this sense, it's a spin. All the same, the idea all art is theft never sat right with me. Maybe it is, but theft is not art. I'm making these videos because I'm particularly inspired by Andrew's work. At the time of writing, I've made one or two similarly sized videos on another show I have a passion for. I can already see divergences in my style. I've become confident and ambitious. My videos have developed from Andrew's blueprint but I'd feel like a dick if I didn't acknowledge what started out as mimicry. Andrew, if you're seeing this, I'm sorry if you felt I've done a jazz or a browned off. Your videos facilitated an artist's journey in me. I hope that brings you happiness. If you watch him, feel pride in igniting the spark behind these. I hope you'll check out his peep show videos. They're passionate and analytical and really good. And there's a link in the description. Thank you all for listening.